This year's Zurich Classic of New Orleans was the first team event on the PGA Tour since 1981. When it came to picking a partner, it was an easy decision for Billy Horschel and Matt Every. The pair met 13 years ago and have been firm friends ever since. Golfing World joined them at nearby Stonebridge Golf Club to find out how their friendship came about during a round of golf with a difference. Hey, I'm Billy Horschel. I'm playing for West Ham United. We're here at Stonebridge Golf Club. Play a little foot golf. Hey, I'm Matt Every. Today I'll be playing for Manchester City. Who are we playing for? 20 bucks a hole? Let's just play 100 to the winner. Okay. All right. Oh. Is that ball regulation? <laughs> oh, oh, I hooked it oh. too much. Looks like one of my drives. <laughs> Bend it like Beckham over here. I had to play along the ground, keep it out of the wind. Oh, oh I hooked it again. Dude, hooks. I'm going. Go in the water. Sit. Get in the water. Sit. You might be away still. It's like Yaya Torre right there. I'll play the break here a little bit, probably break a little right. Come on. Not bad. Not bad. Oh, are you kidding me? That should have broke in. That should have broke in. He can finish out. Oh. Oh. <laughs> he got <almost> caught it. <laughs> oh, this going to be a great, great win for me on this hole. Oh, my God. Here we go. Oh! What are you going for? This is uh, three, four, this is five. All right. Oh, that's five for Matty right here. Oh, what a clutch. Oh, there we go. That was clutch. Oh, tied up through one. So I met Billy, um, we played in a qualifier together. USA qualifier. Yeah, he's a little younger than 2000, me. 2000, uh, 2004. Yeah, I was in school already. I think he was in high school. And we got paired together, you know, randomly. Um, my first impressions, uh, they're the same as they are now. Um, I thought he was just full of energy, big heart, just happy to be alive. And he's a good person. I remember playing with Matt, and obviously Matt was uh, by far the best player in the qualifier. And, he got through easy, and what was weird is second round, um, you know, we have a couple holes left, and he's gonna make, he's gonna make the cut, obviously, to get to U.S. Amateur. And he goes, "Dude, come here, you gotta feel this." And at the time, he had an irregular heartbeat and arrhythmia, and you go over to feel his heart, and I mean, it was beating so weird and stuff. I never, I don't felt remember before. that at all. Yeah, it was weird, <laughs> and uh, so I was like, "Dude, this guy's unbelievable." I mean, he's kicking my butt, and he's got this heart problem too. I'm like, "Gosh." Yeah. Matt's a great friend of mine, love him to death, man. I'd do anything for him in the world. Same. Bite. Go. I was trying Sit. to take a cart path route. That's all right. Uh, I didn't kick it hard enough. Go. That's running out. I'll take it. That's good. Uh, I think I pulled an oblique there. <laughs> Go, get over the hill. Get over the hill. Get right. Oh, it's not bad. Oh, this could, this is dangerous. Oh God, that looked good. You got robbed. It does lip out rather easily. Oh, I, I shanked it. Try to be too easy with it. I'll finish okay. up. Okay. Oh. God. Got the yips. All, All right. square still. All square. All square. Last hole. Billy, um, best quality. Oh, he's got a big heart. Um, he does, just doesn't give up. There's no, he doesn't have any, you know, he's the guy who's gonna run out the ground ball to first base every time. I'm probably a little different, but I think that's taken him a long ways in golf and life. I think one thing that Matt does, and maybe he realizes it or not, he, he listens really well. I mean, when someone comes in, if I come to him, you know, 
there's an issue I'm having, whether it's personal or golf-wise, he's, he's there with uh, open ears and listening, and, and you know, he's got great advice, and he's just a really good friend. I think outside golf, you know, and in public, people don't know the true Matt, but the people that are close to Matt, um, they know they know the kind of guy he is. And uh, if he's your friend, he'll go to bat for you in any circumstance. So that's, uh, that's the guy you want, you know, by your side. All right, enough of the sappy stuff. Let's go. Final hole, baby. Money on the line. <clears throat> oh, man, you play a long. Oh, oh, took a little bit of speed off, which was nice. It helped. I hit My that ball's good. running. Yeah, that's all right. Kind of got stood up. I did. We need one of these in Jacksonville. That'd be fun to go do. Get the guys. We should open one up. Oh, this could turn out really good. Yeah, it could. Keep going. Keep going. Oh, baby. Uh. God damn it. Woo! Oh, get away from the tree. Oh, this. This is okay too. Go. Oh, <laughs> look at this. Come down to the chip shot. That was sick. That was sick. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Ah. Where's the next hole that we're playing for sudden death? <laughs> oh. Come on, we're going sudden death. <laughs> Just like Augusta, the Masters, when there's sudden death, you go back to 18. Same thing here at Stonebridge Golf Club. 18, all on the line, winner takes all. Let's go. Oh, oh yes. Advantage Matt. Oh, Billy Boy. That's not good. Same one as last time. Go in the water. Get in the water. Stay out of the water. Stay out of the water. Yes. Are you kidding me? It's a miracle. Get this on camera, it's going in. Oh, did he hit it hard enough? I did, get in. No, it's not gonna get there. Get in. No way. Oh, go baby, go! Go! We're gonna tie now, I'm gonna miss that. I've got no, no stance over here, no run up. You have to, whoa, water ball. This is interesting. Bite! Oh man, I'm gonna have to make a little shot. Finish me off. Oh, didn't hit it. He's playing short. He's playing safe. He's playing safe. Take it. Just tap it in. We're going to let the wind come through first. Let it die down a little bit. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, you got to go right. Oh. There we go. Yeah, finish me out. Oh. Justin Rose, Sergio Garcia. <laughs> Enjoyed it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs>